O sacred feast, in, in which, which we part of Christ, Christ his sufferings, sufferings are remembered, remembered. Our, our minds are filled with his grace, and, and we receive the pledge of the glory which is to be ours. ours. You gave them bread from heaven to be their food, and this bread contained all goodness. Let us pray. Lord Jesus Christ, you, you gave us the Eucharist as a memorial of your suffering and death. May, May our worship of this sacrament of your, of your body and blood help us to experience salvation you want for, for us. And the and peace of the, of the kingdom, kingdom we are with the Father and the Son, Holy Spirit, God forever and, and ever. Amen. Amen. The angel of the Lord declared unto Mary, and she conceived by the power of the Holy Spirit. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for our sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Behold the handmaid of the Lord. Be it done to me according to your word. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. And the Word was made flesh, and dwelt among us. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Pray for us, O Holy Mother of God, that we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. Let us pray. Pour forth, we, we beseech, beseech you, o Lord, o Lord, your, your grace, grace into our hearts, hearts that, that we to whom the incarnation of Christ, your Son, was made known by the message of an angel, may by his passion and cross be brought to the glory of his resurrection. Through the same Christ, our Lord. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Lord, open my lips, and my mouth shall declare your praise. God, come to my assistance. Lord, make haste to help me. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The five glorious mysteries. The first mystery is the resurrection. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not to temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. 
Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The second glorious mystery is the Ascension. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The third glorious mystery is the descent of the Holy Spirit. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not to temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. 
Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The fourth glorious mystery is the Assumption of Mary. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Five glorious mystery is the coronation of Mary. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. 
Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not to temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. We fly to your patronage, O Holy, o Holy Mother, Mother of God, God despise not our petitions, petitions in our necessities, but deliver us from all dangers, O ever-glorious and blessed Virgin. Virgin. Queen of the Holy Rosary of Manawak, pray for us, that we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. Let us pray. O God, whose only begotten Son, by His, by his life, life, death, and resurrection, has purchased for us the rewards of eternal life, life. Grant, we beseech you, that meditating upon these mysteries of the Holy Rosary of the Blessed Virgin Mary, we may imitate what they contain and obtain what they promise, through Christ our Lord. Amen. Behold the faithful and prudent steward, whom the Lord has sent over his household. The Lord has shown him his love and covered him with glory. He has clothed it with, it with a splendid garment. Let us pray. Father, you, you entrust us our, our Saviour to the care, care of St. Joseph. Joseph. By, By the help of his prayers, prayers may your church, church continue, continue to serve our Lord Jesus Christ, who lives and reigns with you and the Holy, and the Holy Spirit, God, God forever, forever and, and ever. Amen. Amen. Jubilee Prayer O God, our Father and Creator, in whom, in whom we live, live and, move and move and have our being, we praise you as we gather in gentle grace and gratitude on this jubilee of the Dominican province of the Philippines. O God, God the Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, Jesus Christ we preach you as the way, the, the truth, and the life, whose name we proclaim, whose life we strive to incarnate. O God, the Holy Spirit, advocate and guide, we bless you and seek the outpouring of your presence in the witness of our words and works, in the consecration of our lives to holy preaching. In speaking only to you, you and about you, let our celebration be filled with fidelity to our mission, with hope for your promise, and with true charity binding us all. 
in the, in the gospel, gospel we share with all with peoples. By your will, O God, in your name, name O Lord. Amen. Amen. Our Lady of the Holy Rosary, pray for us. Our Holy Father, Saint Dominic, pray for us. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Please be seated for a while. Good morning, brothers and sisters. Welcome to the Minor Basilica of Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawa. Today is Wednesday in the 15th week of Ordinary Time. We will now have the morning prayer of the Church integrated with the celebration of the Holy Mass. We invite you to actively participate in our prayers. Please stand. Lord, open my lips, and my, my mouth, mouth shall declare, declare your, your praise. praise. Come, let us worship before the Lord, our Maker. Come, let us worship before the Lord, our Maker. Cry out with joy to the Lord, all the earth. Serve the Lord with gladness. Come before Him, singing for joy. Come, let us worship before the Lord, our Maker. Know that He, the Lord, is God. He made us. We belong to Him. We are His people, the sheep of His flock. Come, let us worship before the Lord, our Maker. Go within His gates, giving thanks. Enter His courts with song of praise. Give thanks to Him and bless His name. Come, let us worship before the Lord, our Maker. Indeed, how good is the Lord, eternal His merciful love. He is faithful from age to age. Come, let us worship before the Lord, our Maker. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Come, let us worship before the Lord, our Maker. Please be seated. Give joy to your servant, Lord. To you I lift up my heart. Turn your ear, O Lord, and give answer, for I am poor and needy. Preserve my life, for I am faithful. Save the servant who trusts in you. You are my God. Have mercy on me, Lord. For I cry to you all the day long. Give joy to your servant, O Lord, for to you I lift up my soul. O Lord, you are good and forgiving, full of love to all who call. Give heed, O Lord, to my prayer, and attend to the sound of my voice. In the day of distress I will call, and surely you will reply. Among the gods there is none like you, O Lord, nor work to compare with yours. All the nations shall come to adore you, and glorify your name, O Lord, for you are great and do marvelous deeds. You alone are God. Show me, Lord, your way, so that I may walk in your truth. Guide my heart to fear your name. I will praise you, Lord my God, with all my heart, and glorify your name forever. For your love to me has been great. You have saved me from the depths of the grave. The proud have risen against me. Ruthless men seek my life. To you they pay no heed. But you, God of mercy and compassion, slow to anger, O Lord, abounding in love and truth, turn and take pity on me. O, go, o give your strength to your servant, and save your handmaid's son. Show me a sign of your favor, that my foes may see to their shame, that you console me and give me your help. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Blessed is the upright man who speaks the truth. Hear, you who are far off, what I have done. You who are near, acknowledge my might. On Zion sinners are in dread, trembling grieves the impious. Who of us can live with a consuming fire? Who of us can live with the everlasting flames? He who practices virtue and speaks honestly, who spurn what is gained by oppression, brushing his hands free of contact with the bride, stopping his ears lest he hear of bloodshed, closing his eyes 
lest he look on evil. He shall dwell on the heights. His stronghold shall be the rocky fastness, his food and drink in steady supply. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Let us celebrate with joy in the presence of our Lord and King. Sing a new song to the Lord, for He has worked wonders. His right hand and His holy arm have brought salvation. The Lord has made known His salvation, has shown His justice to the nations. He has remembered His truth and love for the house of Israel. All the ends of the earth have seen the salvation of our God. Shout to the Lord, all the earth, ring out your joy. Sing psalm to the Lord with the harp, with the sound of music, with trumpets and the sound of the horn. Acclaim the King, the Lord. Let the sea and all within it thunder, the world and all its peoples. Let the rivers clap their hands, and the hills ring out their joy. Rejoice at the presence of the Lord, for He comes to the rule the earth. He will rule the world with justice, and the peoples with fairness. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Please stand. Let us pray. O God, who show the lights of your truth to those who go astray, so that they may return to the right path. Give all who for the faith they profess are accounted Christians the grace to reject whatever is contrary to the name of Christ, and to strive after all that does it honor. Through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, God, forever and ever. Amen. Please be seated. A reading from the book of the prophet Isaiah. Thus says the Lord, Woe to Assyria, my rod in anger, my staff in wrath. <coughs> Against an impious nation I send him, and against a people under my wrath I order him to seize plunder, carry off loot, and tread them down like the mud of the streets. But this is not what he intends, nor does he have this in mind. Rather, it is in his heart to destroy, to make an end of nations, not a few. For he says, by my own power I have done it, and by my wisdom, for I am shrewd. I have moved the boundaries of peoples, their treasures I have pillaged, and like a giant, I have put down the enthroned. My hand has seized like a nest the riches of nations. As one takes eggs left alone, so I took in all the earth. No one fluttered a wing or opened a mouth or cheer. Will the axe boast against him who use with it? Will the saw exalt itself above him who wields it? As if a rod could sway him who lifts it, or a staff him who is not wood. Therefore the Lord, the Lord of hosts, will send among his fat ones leanness, and instead of his glory there will be kindling, like the kindling of fire. The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. The Lord will not abandon his people. The Lord will not abandon his people. Your people, O Lord, they trample down. Your inheritance they afflict. Widow and stranger they slay. The fatherless they murder. The Lord will abandon his people. And they say, The Lord sees not. The God of Jacob perceives not. Understand. You are senseless ones among the people, and you fools, when will you be wise? The Lord will not abandon his people. Shall he who shake the ear not hear, or he who form the eye not see? Shall he who instructs nations not chastise, he who teaches men knowledge? The Lord will not abandon his people. For the Lord will not cast off his people, nor abandon his inheritance. 
but judgment shall again be with justice, and all the upright of heart shall follow it. The Lord will not abandon his people. Please stand. Blessed are you, Father, Lord of heaven and earth. You have revealed to little ones the mysteries of the kingdom. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to Matthew. Glory to you, O Lord. At that time, Jesus ex exclaimed, I give praise to you, Father, Lord of heaven and earth, for although you have hidden these things from the wise and the learned, you have revealed them to the childlike. Yes, Father, such has been your gracious will. All things have been handed over to me by my Father. No one knows the Son except the Father, and no one knows the Father except the Son, and anyone to whom the Son wishes to reveal Him. The Gospel of the Lord. Praise to you, Lord Jesus Christ. Please be seated. Yesterday, our Lord Jesus Christ Decided these three cities of Chorazin, Bitsaida, and Capernaum. Bakit? Kasi maraming ginawa ang ating Panginoon, mga milagro, mga pagtuturo, sa mga syudad o bayan na ito. Ngunit, walang naniniwala. Sabi nga ng ating Panginoon, kung ginawa niya ito sa Sidon and Tyre noon, siguro baka yung mga tao nag-repent, mga tao nagbalik loob sa Diyos, at hanggang ngayon, buhay pa. O ganun din sa Sodom. Alam po natin na ang kwento ng Sodom, the worst city in terms of morality. But then, sabi ng ating Panginoon, kung naabutan po lamang niya siguro, baka nagbago itong bayang ito. Hindi katulad nitong Chorasin, Bitsaida, and Capernaum. Mas worst, most probably, ang mangyayari sa kanila, sa hindi nila pagtanggap sa pagginawa ng ating Panginoon. Sa ating Ibanghilyo sa araw na ito, ang ganda ng dasal ng ating Panginoon, dasal niya para sa mga taong simple lamang ang buhay, sa mga taong mayroong paniniwala, katulad ng bata, childlike faith, simple, humble, in their faith, in their belief, kaya Pinagdasal niya ang kanya mga disipulo. Sino ba itong mga disipulo? Gasaan galing ba itong mga disipulo ng ating Panginoon? These are simple fishermen, most probably farmers, and some other persons who are childlike, who follow immediately. 
an educated. Hindi yung mga professionals na hindi naniniwala sa kanya. This is actually a reflection of how the church grow, how Christianity grow. It started from the simple faith of those people in the grassroots. Yung mga ordinaryong tao na naniniwala sa kanya, remember, that Jesus is going around teaching people about the kingdom of God, about the truth, at sino yung sumasama sa kanya, sumusunod sa kanya. Itong mga taong nasa laylayan, at yung mga taong nasa templo, the Pharisees, the scribes, those people who are intellectuals try to question Him instead of believing Him. Pero yung ordinaryong tao ang siyang naniniwala sa Kanya. But later on, we know that Christianity indeed is a universal calling. It is not only certainly for ordinary people because later on, those intellectuals, when they opened their minds and accepted the truth, they were able to grasp and follow Jesus. And we know that. You have good examples of San Agustin, Santo Tomas de Aquino, Henry Newman. These are intellectuals who, lay, who embrace and love the church of Jesus. So it is not only for the grassroots, but also for those intellectuals who humble themselves and ready to accept the truth, to embrace the kingdom of God. We know that to know the Father is a gift. Kilala, makilala lamang po natin ang Ama sa pamagitan ng anak. At alam po natin na ito ay isang regalo para sa isa't isa sa atin. Regalo dahil libre ito. Ang pagturo ng ating Panginoon ay walang bayad at hindi binabayaran. Ang pagturo ng ating Panginoon tungkol sa Ama ay para sa mga nakikinig at naniniwala. Kaya, isang regalo na dapat alagaan natin na kung ating narinig ito at pinaniniwalaan, ito ay lalaki at magbibigay sa atin ng ating kaligtasan. Because we believe on the kingdom of God. Sa buhay natin, sigurado na kakatok ang ating Panginoon sa ating mga pintuan. Handa ba tayo sa pagtanggap sa Kanya kapag sinabi niya yung katotohanan kapag sinabi niya ang tungkol sa kaharian ng Diyos handa ba tayo sa pagbukas sa kanyang 
mga sinasabi sa ating ang pagwawasto sa ating mga paniniwala. Handa ba tayo sa pag-alaga ng kalikasan? Handa ba tayo sa pag-alaga ng buhay? Handa ba tayo sa pag-alaga ng magandang relasyon? Sa kasal, relasyon sa mga anak, sa magulang. Handa ba tayo na itakwil ang pagpatay lalo ng lalo na ng kabataan like abortion? Hindi lamang yung mga biktima ng injustisya. Handa ba tayo sa pagtaguyod ng katotohanan na turo ng ating simbahan. The dear friends, we must be ready to accept the truth. Kung gusto natin makasama sa kaharian ng Diyos, then I think we must be humble enough to accept the truth, to accept Jesus. Kasi pag, kapag hindi natin matanggap ang ating Panginoon, hindi tayo maniniwala sa tinuturo ng simbahan. We will question, lalong-lalo na kapag uh, nakapag-aral tayo, nakapagbasa tayo, nakapag-research tayo, There will be questions, a lot of questions. But then, the wisdom of God is greater than man, the wisdom of man. Tandaan natin yan. Hanggang hindi natin isurrender ang ating sarili, sa ating Panginoon, lalong-lalo na sa Kanyang tinuturo sa atin. We will not able to know the Father and we will not enter the kingdom of heaven. We'll stand. The Father reveals the mysteries of the kingdom to the little ones. Let us pray to our God who shows such love for small and simple people. We bring all our needs before our Heavenly Father. Confident of His loving care, we say, Heavenly Father, bless your children. Heavenly Father, bless your children that the Church may give preferential option for the poor. We pray. Heavenly Father, bless your children. That government leaders may listen to the needs and cries of the humblest citizens. We pray. Heavenly Father, bless your children. That children may get to know God by our teachings and examples. We pray. Heavenly Father, bless your children that the sick may find comfort and healing in the care and concern of those who nurse them. We pray. Heavenly Father, bless your children. For our brothers and ministry at Bahay Domenico in Quezon City and St. Mary Magdalene in Calerwega. We pray. Heavenly Father, bless your children. For the intentions of this Mass, the intentions of the devotees and pilgrims of Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawag, and for our personal intentions. We pray. Heavenly Father, bless your children. 
that all those who have died may enjoy the everlasting happiness in the kingdom of God. We pray. Heavenly Father, bless your children. Lord Jesus Christ, make us wise with your wisdom and help us follow you in the humble way you have shown us. We ask this through Christ our Lord. Amen. Please be seated. Blessed are you, Lord God of all creation, for through your goodness we have received the bread we offer you, fruits of the earth and work of human hands. It will become for us the bread of life. Blessed be God forever. Blessed are you, Lord God of all creation, for through your goodness we have received the wine we offer you, through the divine and work of human hands, it will become our spiritual drink. Blessed be God forever. Please stand. Pray, my dear friends, that my sacrifice and yours may be acceptable to God the Almighty Father. May the Lord accept the sacrifice at your hands for the praise and glory of his name, for our good and the good of his holy, holy church. Look upon the offerings of the church, O Lord, as she makes her prayer to you, and grant that when consumed by those who believe, they may bring ever greater holiness to Christ our Lord. Amen. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. Lift up your hearts. We lift them up to the Lord. Let us give thanks to the Lord our God. It is right and just. It is truly really right and just, our duty and our salvation. Always and everywhere to give you thanks, Lord, Holy Father, Almighty and Eternal God. For just as through your beloved Son, you created the human race. So also through him, with great goodness, you form it anew. And so it is right that all your creatures serve you, all the redeemed praise you, and all your saints with one heart bless you. Therefore we too extol you with all the angels, as in joyful celebration we acclaim. You are indeed holy, O Lord, the fount of holiness. 
Make holy, therefore, these gifts we pray, by sending down your Spirit upon them like the dewfall, so that they may become for us the body and blood of our Lord Jesus Christ. At the time he was betrayed and entered willingly into his passion, he took bread and given thanks, broke it, and gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and eat of it, for this is my body, which will be given up for you. In a similar way, when supper was ended, he took the chalice, and once more giving thanks, he gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and drink from it, for this is the chalice of my blood, the blood of the new and eternal covenant, which will be poured out for you and for many for the forgiveness of sins. Do this in memory of me. The Mystery of Faith Therefore, as we celebrate the memorial of his death and resurrection, we offer you, Lord, the bread of life and the chalice of salvation, giving thanks that you have healed us worthy to be in your presence and minister to you. Humbly we pray that partaking of the body and blood of Christ, we might be gathered into one by the Holy Spirit. Remember, Lord, your church spread throughout the world, and bring her to the fullness of charity, together with Francis our Pope, Socrates our Archbishop, Fidelis his assistant, Gerard our Master of the Order, the religious and all the clergy. Remember also our brothers and sisters who have fallen asleep in the hope of the resurrection, and all who have died in your mercy. Welcome them into the light of your face. Have mercy on us all, we pray, that with the Blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of God, with Blessed Joseph, her spouse, with the Blessed Apostles, with our Father Saint Dominic, and all the saints who have pleased you throughout the ages, we may merit to be co-heirs to eternal life, and we praise and glorify you through your Son, Jesus Christ. Through him, and with him, and in him, O God, Almighty Father, in the unity of the Holy Spirit, all glory and honor is yours forever and ever. Please all stand. At the Savior's command and form by divine teaching, we dare to say, Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not to temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Deliver us, Lord, we pray, from every evil. Graciously grant peace in our days, that by the help of your mercy, we might be always free from sin and safe from all distress, as we await the blessed hope 
and the coming of our Savior, Jesus Christ. For the kingdom, the power, and the glory are yours now and forever. Lord Jesus Christ said to the apostles, Peace I love you, my peace I give you. Look not on our sins, but on the faith of your church, and graciously grant our peace and unity in accordance with your will, who live and reign forever and ever. Amen. The peace of the Lord be with you always. And with your spirit. Let us offer each other the sign of peace. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world, have mercy on us. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world, have mercy on us. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world, grant us peace. Please kneel. Behold Jesus, the Son of the living God the Lamb of God who takes away the sins of the world. Blessed are those called to the supper of the Lamb. Lord, I am not worthy that you should enter under my roof, but, but only say the word, my and my soul shall be healed. Show us your mercy, Lord. Remember your holy covenant. Blessed be the Lord, the God of Israel. He has come to his people and set them free. He has you raised for us, for us a mighty Savior, Savior born, born of the house of his servant, David. David. Through his holy prophets, he promised of old that he would save us from our enemies, from the hands of all who hate us. He, he promised to show mercy to our fathers, fathers and, to and to remember his God. holy covenant. This was the oath he swore to our father Abraham, to set us free from the hands of our enemies, free to worship him without fear, holy and righteous in his sight all the days of our life. You, you my child, shall be called, called the prophet, prophet of the Most High, High for, you, for you, you will go before the Lord to prepare his way, to give his people knowledge of salvation 
by the forgiveness of their sins. In the tender compassion of our God, the dawn from on high shall break upon us to shine on those who dwell in darkness, in the shadow of death, and to guide our feet into the way of peace. Glory, Glory be to, to the, the Father, and to the Son, and to the, Son, and to the Holy Spirit, Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Show us your mercy, mercy Lord. Lord. Remember, Remember your, your holy, holy covenant. covenant. Let us pray. Having consumed these gifts, we pray, O Lord, that by our participation in this mystery, its saving effects upon us may grow to Christ our Lord. Amen. Thank you very much for your presence, especially for your active participation and cooperation during this Eucharistic celebration. We continue praying for one another and let us keep safe, especially during this time. Pandemic is not yet over. Please include in your prayers our frontliners here in the minor basilica of Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawag. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. May Almighty God bless you, the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. The Mass is ended. Go in peace. Thanks be to God. We will now have the blessing of our sick brothers and sisters. Please, in silence, remember the names of your loved ones who are sick, and we offer this blessing. We will also bless your religious articles. Our hope is in the name of the Lord. Who made heaven and earth. Let us pray. God, our almighty Father, by your blessing, you give us strength and support in our frailty. Serve your kindness toward our sick brothers and sisters. Free them from all illness and restore them to good health through the intercession of our Lady of the Rosary of Manawag, so that in the sure knowledge of your goodness, they will gratefully bless your holy name in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. For your religious articles, in memory of the mysteries of the life, death, and resurrection of our Lord Jesus Christ, to the honor and glory of the Blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of Christ, Mother of the Church, Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawag, may all these rosaries, images, candles, oil, and other religious articles be blessed and made holy in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen.